Named actor in Hollywood is now accused of sexual assault. Two women have come forward claiming Steven Seagal attacked them. They're speaking out and they've hired a lawyer. KCAL 9's Cara Finstrom is live at attorney Lisa Bloom's office in Woodland Hills. Cara. Yeah, Juan, several actresses have actually now come forward with allegations against the 80s action star today. In these offices, two of those women and their attorneys spoke out. He closed the door and approached me from behind. He started kissing my neck and taking off my clothes. Actresses Regina Simons and Fabiola Dottis say Steven Seagal sexually assaulted them both as teenagers. Today they talked about what happened publicly. Simon said she was invited to a rap party at Seagal's home, but when she arrived, found herself alone with the actor and he raped her. I was not sexually active, nor had I ever been naked in front of a man before. I froze. Dada says she was a 17 year old minor when she was asked to come with a bikini to an audition. She says she was taken to Seagal's room and he sexually assaulted her. Well, I was noticeably upset and terrified by the experience. Steven's security guard stood blocking the doorway and only moved when Steven motioned for him to do so. Today, the women's attorney, Lisa Bloom, said no lawsuit has been filed, but that all legal options remain open. Bloom says both women have filed reports with the LAPD and that New York City's police department is also investigating claims. Simons and Dada say they spoke today to help encourage all sexual assault victims to come forward. I'm thankful for the Me Too movement and the many brave people who came before me. Some of the other actresses who've made allegations against Seagal, Jennifer McCarthy and also Portia DeRosi. Uh, and Juan, we can tell you that Seagal and his attorneys have spoken to the media in the past denying various allegations. Very serious ones too.